Introducing Danny Danube. Danny wants to visit a friend. Unfortunately, she lives far, far away. So Danny packs his suitcase and sets off. Danny is traveling by public transport, which offers him many options. But there's one problem. Traveler information is provided by different services in each country and often in foreign languages. Does it have to be so complicated? Danny asks himself. And then he thinks, what if you could plan your entire cross-border journey with one single service? The European Commission had the same idea. For this reason, in 2017, it adopted the Delegated Act with regard to the provision of EU-wide multimodal travel information services and the OJP standard was developed. So what's the idea behind this? Instead of collecting and managing all data and information centrally, as in a centralized architecture, all data remains with the local journey planners when planning cross-border trips. Only the routing results are exchanged and interlinked. This is called linking of services. This linking of services is enabled by OJP, making use of an open API for distributed journey planning. Different services are interlinked via a harmonized interface based on the OJP standard. The feasibility of this system was analyzed and successfully tested in practice within the Linking Danube project. Ten partners from six Danube region countries work together within Linking Danube. The result is a successful proof of concept for the linking of services. The Danube region journey planner links six different traveler information services and enables seamless cross-border and cross-operator journey planning. So, if Danny wants to know the best option for traveling to his friend, he sends a request to his local service provider. The linking of services enables this request to be split between the different services. They calculate their part of the route. These results are assembled and presented to Danny by his familiar service provider. And how does Danny benefit from this? By simplified journey planning, using his trusted traveler information service. Danny receives the complete route planning, including alternative suggestions, directly on his mobile phone. So he can plan his journey from door to door very easily, also across national and operational borders. This way, the linking of services can foster efficient and sustainable public transport. Travelers will benefit from enhanced and accurate traveler information. And last but not least, all service providers will benefit from satisfied travelers. Linking Danube was the first initiative to demonstrate a functioning network of interlinked journey planners using one central node that includes the necessary logic to manage the requests and assemble the route. In future, this could be extended to more local systems using different central nodes. In any event, the travel information service providers retain their data sovereignty. Linking Danube was developed by Austria Tech together with nine project partners. The project is funded within the Interreg Danube Transnational Program. Further information on Linking Danube is available online and in the Linking Danube brochure.